Christmas isn't over yet, is it? Or is it? Anyway, I thought I'd make another video. So, before the end of the year here. Because people have been asking me if I can release the chessboard. Which I think is a good idea. So, but I need to review it first. So I will review it, then release it. So, by the end of this video, I have released it. I was thinking maybe someone else could check it for me. Uh, but then mostly people don't have sprint layout, so I was thinking maybe exporting the layers to Gerber and maybe GIMP, so you can turn off and on layers, it's really easy, but this is a small board, so I will just do it myself, it's no problem. So what I've done, and the nice thing about the light version or the backlit version is that uh, everything shows up, so I can even see those tiny guys, like that one. And I've changed all the colors of my layer and holes to the same as the background. So, in theory, if something is wrong, we should see something black. And the only, only thing I can see is basically just these uh, little thingies here of a, of a bob. <laughs> Thing of a bob. Yeah, so I think this looks good now. So, I will finish up this text, as you can see. Components, really easy to make, actually. And maybe if I if I bother, <laughs> I will do also these guys. Uh, we can. Um, they are like on a half layer thing, half 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 layer or something, because I was working on this layer, and as you can see, it stops in the middle sometimes. So that means I have to go even a step further down. I can do that, but uh, I mean, is it really that important? Not sure. Well, I do that, then everything becomes green here, and then I know everything's all right. It's very satisfying, this. So, don't you think? This uh, tiny grid. Look. Oh, 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 oh. Nailed it, don't you think? Now, when I'm finished with this, I'm going to hate 45 degree bands because if you look closely, they are actually all of them are 45, not 90. So I have to do this all over again. It's a bit slow process, but uh, okay. It can be done, it's just a little bit boring. <laughs> Let's make perfect coffee. And another reason for doing this is also that I get to check when I do this, I can actually get to inspect. So it's not a waste of time really. I get to see if something is wrong. So basically. Ugurka said that the, the uh, layout guy had to be drunk. And yeah, kind of, it kind of looks like it, like up here. And um, but I think what happens is that, um, well, it's very, very consistent everywhere. But sometimes it makes really strange choices, uh, like here, for example. Why would you want to go straight up and then to the left? Why can't you just go away from everything? No, I think it's auto routing. Like here, for example, there's a perimeter where the board is going to be mounted, so you need space around the screw hole so you can uh, mount the thing without uh, adding pressure to any traces. So here, the um, auto router is probably <laughs> thinking this is a round shape, right? Uh, wow, well, okay. <laughs> Are we there yet? Daddy! Are we there yet? Are we done? I don't want to see 45 degrees anymore. It's so boring. It takes forever. And there's a lot of them. Quiet sun. 99 beers on the wall. Something. Let's put on some YouTube music. Done with the board. 
you can see the top side Button replica 1.0 so we know that if there's a new version we know what to do so <laughs> strangely when I was done with this I had checked everything very closely and you can see I'm, I don't want to see a 45 degree bend anymore because I've done all of them and there's a lot of them so but then I was like okay I like checked everything while I did that but then <laughs> I just opened one of the images like this and I saw this wow I was missing that one I thought that was just uh, an artifact or something but uh, I didn't have them side by side, but in my mind I knew I had something wrong. So, <laughs> so I made I think I made the Gerbers like 30 times or something. So to make the Gerbers you just go to export, Gerber export, and then uh, copper layer top and bottom, and then the outline. Anyway, the other thing you have to export is the uh, drill file. Then when you do that, you get the f these files here, which are basically drill, uh, top, bottom, and outline. So I have renamed them. That's because some um, board manufacturers they like these endings, or else you just get uh, these GBR, GBR, GBR. That will also work for some, but uh, there's some vendors that don't like them, so just be aware of that. If it doesn't work, just rename them to GBR. So, but I've tested it with uh, the most common ones. Yay! Yanni linked my video. Hooray! <laughs> Thank you very much, Yanni. So this is the GitHub page. The final chess card just published it so yeah that's basically it so here you have the zip file that you can send to get manufactured and then you can well first you actually have to clone or download zip for this project then you get the zip file in there <clears throat> we have some preview picture this is the spring layout file so yeah that's it and thank you very much for watching and I hope you have a good new year and uh, I hope to talk to you very soon and I feel like I have something more to say but uh, I think I will leave it at that.